Hi everyone, today we're going to look at how to submit Group A CPE credits in the ISC2 CPE portal. Activities related to one or more of the domains in your ISC2 certification are eligible for Group A CPE credits. See the Certification Maintenance Handbook for the full list of options including ISC2 webinars and activities from other sources. Let's start by signing in and navigating to the CPE portal. The first step is to enter the start and end dates for your activity. In our case, reading a white paper. Make sure the dates are within your membership cycle. Let's say we started the paper on January 1 and finished January 3, 2024. Click the Continue button. Now choose the category from the pull-down menu. In our case, it's Education. We'll select Book, Magazine, White Paper, and add the details. Title, AI Security in a Zero Trust Environment. Author, Jane Smith. Publication Group, White Paper. Year published, 2024. In the credits field, you'll notice the one automatically appears and can't be edited. That's because all white papers count for one credit. If you're submitting a different activity and this field requires you to manually enter a number, see the Certification Maintenance Handbook for how many credits to apply. General guidance for claiming CPE credits is one credit per hour. You may submit up to 40 CPE credits per activity. In the summary field, we'll describe what we learned from the white paper. I learned that AI security in zero trust environments continues to evolve and require specialized considerations. For supporting documentation, we'll add a PDF of the white paper. It's important to note the max file size and supported file types before uploading. If you don't have supporting documentation, you can leave this field blank as long as you detail what you learned in the description field. Now click the Save and Continue button. Choose one or more certification domain topics covered in the white paper. We'll select Security Operations. Click Save and Continue to review your information, then click the Submit CPE button. Your submission is confirmed. It's important to note, once you submit CPE credits, you can no longer edit the information. If you choose to make changes, you can delete the activity and start fresh. Check your member dashboard for updates. Looking for more information on how to submit Group B CPE credits? Watch the next video in our how-to series.